having a wonderful, wonderful Sunday. It is Sunday morning for me. And um, I am so sorry about not getting this up before. I came down with a horrible headache the last couple days. So um, it just didn't happen. I apologize. Okay, so I have this one and then I have another one that I'll be doing tomorrow. And then I have a couple more that are supposed to be on their way. So it's just going to be a whole like Diamond Art Club unboxing week, I guess. Okay. Um, I also have another unboxing that I might post today. I know I don't usually do two at a time or two in one day, but I really want to get it up there because I'm already working on it. So, and I've had a lot of people ask about it and where I got it and all that good stuff. So, uh, you might just get two today, guys. Okay. So this one, um, and a friend sent me and I'm so excited about it because it's not your typical, it's not one that I... Um, that you might expect me to get, but I'm obsessed. So we got two stickers, which I will show you in just a couple minutes. Um, we have our kit here, which is, it is a round painting. As you can tell, it says round right there. Uh, don't pay attention to my janky nails. Anyways, the difference between a round and a square kit is the square kits come with tweezers. The round do not. This kit will have a pen, um, a squishy, some bags, a tray, wax, pretty much it just has everything you need. Plus guys, we got gold in there. They are doing four placers in all of their kits, which I think is awesome because everybody loves a good four placer, right? All right. Um, that's like one of the things that, uh, is requested most actually at my shop is four three and four placers. So I think it's awesome that they're um, including them now in all of their kits. Okay, so the reason I decided to do this one today and the other one tomorrow is the other one is bigger and um, my husband is home and I have to do that one on my bed because I don't have enough space on my desk. So um, he will be at work tomorrow. So I figured I can just do that tomorrow when he's at work and I can do this one today. Well, um, at my desk. So we got our drills, which I will put to the side, but we will be pulling those back out in just a minute. If you're new to diamond painting, where is it? Did I, or did I lose it? Did I not send it? Um, I'm trying to find a little pamphlet. Anyways, it's probably around here somewhere. Um, if you are new to diamond painting, I highly suggest looking at that because it does have some good tips and tricks on how to diamond paint and everything. And also there it is. See, I knew it was in there. Um, it also has some good, um, a good coupon on there for you for, uh, some money off of your next painting. Okay. So I'm going to turn this one actually to the side. Actually, it doesn't matter. It's a square. So I'm going to turn it this way. It's going to be fine. Um, all right. If you don't know, guys, okay, well, I'm just gonna turn it over first of all. Okay, here we go. Ready? One, two, and three. Oh, yes. Okay. If you don't know this about me, I am obsessed with butterflies. Love butterflies. Have them all over. I just, I love them. Um, me and Maddie actually did like a, this project where we got tiny little um, eggs outside on the bushes, and we literally raised like 40 from tiny eggs all the way up to beautiful butterflies when we let them go and it was so much fun and it just like kind of fueled the love for me um but i i absolutely love butterflies and i love the color in this one i think it's absolutely gorgeous it is a partial so it's gonna make it really stand out now if you know me you know i'm not a huge fan of partials however i think there is like the right kind of partial if that makes sense like this I think is beautiful because it's going to make it kind of pop off the page. Um, whereas if all of this background had drills too, it would be more, you know, one dimensional. And now that there's, you know, it, there's two dimensions because there's no drills on the background. Make sense? Okay. I'm sure I didn't explain that well, but you probably understand what I'm saying. Okay. Even though this is only a 56 by 56 and it is a partial, there are still 41 colors in this guys. Look at these beautiful colors. There's, I, I, this one is gonna be so much fun to work on because of all the colors. It is gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. And I really like the background. Um, it's like this tan, um, 
kind of clothy look. I don't know. I'll, I'll try to get like a little up close in just a second, but it's, it's really, really pretty. The artist of this one is Sharon Cummings. And so I already said it's 56 by 56 centimeters, or if you go by inches, it's 22 by 22 inch. Um, so, and that is from this to this. All right. Not the whole canvas. It is just your drill field area. Um, so now, oh, by the way, there are two ABs, 132 and two, which is 132 is a yellow and 138 is a blue. Um, and so those are going to be really, really pretty to make this pop even more. So now what I'm going to do is we're going to pull that camera up close. We're going to look at the drill fields and we're going to see where all these beautiful ABs are. Now, um, as you can see the material, let me pull this up just a little bit. So you don't get that glare so much. There we go. So see how it's like this tan kind of like almost like old kind of looking fabric is kind of how it reminds me of. But I really, really like it. I think it's really pretty. And then we have our drill field, which of course is clear as day. I mean, you can see this. You don't need a light pad if you don't have one. Not a problem because these symbols are so, so, so clear. Um, as I said before, the ABs are yellow and blue, and so the symbols of those are one and two. So if you can see all of this yellow, all of this number one symbol, you guys, see all that? Yes, all of that is going to be ABs, so you're really going to have a lot of it. And then the number two symbol is the blue, so let's see if we can find them um, find that number two. I'm looking, I'm looking, I don't see it yet, but it could just be that I'm blind as a bat because I don't have my glasses. Um, okay, here it is. So it's this color right here. So it is all throughout. Again, you can kind of see it now that we see what color it is. It's much easier to spot on the canvas. So again, you're going to have this kind of all over the place. Um, and then I might even add some extra ABs just because I like to customize mine, you know, just a little bit more. It makes them, I don't know, it just makes it more fun for me to make it just kind of more my own. Okay, so now we're going to take a look at this. Okay, so you get this extra sticker. You can do whatever the heck you want with it. You can put it on your drills if you want. You can put it on this the box if you keep them in storage. Whatever you want to do, they give you an extra little sticker. Um, you also get the big thumbnail one, which you get your thumbnail, which I put on the top of my, like, Harbor Freight Um storage containers and then on the other one I'll put the dimensions and the title and um, then what you can do is you can cut all the symbols out and individually place them on your Harbor Freight or whatever you use that way you don't have to buy labels you don't have to sit there and hand write all your symbols out because um, just in case you didn't know I, I think I said this but I don't know I'm gonna show y'all anyways um, this entire piece of paper is a sticker you guys so it's really really convenient um so here are all your symbols sorry about the last video they were upside down i apologize how i missed that in editing i don't know i was tired so there's all your symbols and all your colors as i said there are 41 colors two different ab's 132 138 um and all the symbols you know are pretty generic um diamond art club symbols nothing like new crazy or out there and because there's only 41 colors like everything's pretty like i said generic so uh nothing like surprising or being you know i don't see anything that would cause much of a problem the only thing i ever have to really pay attention to is either the triangle um like this one because they'll here it is They'll have it like this corner and then they'll have it on the upper corner or this corner or that corner. And if they have like, let's say two that are um, blue, I'll have to really pay attention to that. Or like this because I'll have that go going both ways or like the arrows or whatever. So, but in this one, I don't see anything that is um, going to pre like present any you know, kind of a problem. The arrows, there's two arrows, but they're totally different colors. So... Yeah, not a big deal. Okay, so that's that. Let's take a look at the drills. We got our pack of drills. 
And right on it, it will say the name Colorful Butterfly, which I think is awesome because I don't store mine in the box anymore because I have just, I had too many boxes. And so I started actually separating them and I have all the drills in the packets like in a container and so this makes it really nice because then I don't have to go in like pre like I don't have to label it myself because it already says what it is so that's very nice these um plastic bags that they're keeping them in seem to be new like they're a lot more sturdy than the other ones were um and so I really like that okay we're gonna put that to the side it's all the little touches do you know what I mean Okay, so we got one all by its lonesome. Um, we got the train of the car, or the car of the train. Is that what, it, yeah, they're called cars, so. We got one all by himself. 947, beautiful orange color. All right, let's grab a train here and start. Here we go. I wonder if there's gonna be any black in this one because I'm so used to having so much black in my paintings, but this one obviously doesn't have like a lot of blacks, which is nice. This will be a breath of fresh air. Okay, we've got 995, uh, 796. And actually, I'm gonna actually turn a light off behind me so that it's just the sunlight so that it, it's really true to color and you don't have the glare. Okay, so I know it's a little bit darker, but now you can see like the actual really true color without that added light to it. So uh, 796, then we got 606. I love that color, so pretty. Um, 38, four to six. This is my absolute favorite DMC code. I love this color blue. It's like a teal blue. We got 814. Baby, so here's your orange, here's your orange gonna be all over that butterfly i love the orange ab's they're so pretty look at that oh they're gorgeous okay then we got 939 which is a really 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 dark blue uh 321 991 i like that one too it's a pretty color uh 742 3843 820 an ab so here's your blue ab which again, gorgeous. If you're not familiar with what an AB drill is, it's just, AB stands for Aurora Borealis. It is just a like a um, iridescent coating over the top of the drill that makes it a little bit shinier, a little, you know, a little extra extra. So as you can see, like this one doesn't have it, this one does. So you can just see that extra little bit of a like iridescent coating onto it. Um, they're the extra drills, okay? All right, we got 740, 702, 704, 823, which is another really dark, dark blue. 733, 3811. I really like working with this color, too. It's really pretty. 905. We got one more train. We got 743. We've got 954. 550, 912, 3371, 700, 3837, 3830, 992, gorgeous, 400, uh, 301, 907. This was like the color of my room as a teenager. I loved neon green. Uh, 993, 165, 3818, 666. 327, 355, 917, and 758. So those are all your gorgeous drills. Um, this one, I'm really, really excited to do this one, especially with being a partial, I'll have it done like lickety split. Um, it's a round, and the title of this one is Colorful Butterfly, if I forgot to say that. So again, Colorful Butterfly by Sharon Cummings, and it is a 56 by 56 square, I mean round, um, uh, partial. Sorry, my brain just went, uh, when I was saying the square, 56 by 56 square, I meant like it's in the shape of a square, but then my brain just got all twisted and, and messed up with the whole like drills shape, you know? So if you don't know, I didn't show the box because I never show you what I'm opening before I open it. Their boxes now are really, really cool because they show you right here if it's a round or a square. So you know, like, you don't even have to really look. It just shows. It's also another color. So it's really nice how it's just, like, 
right there. Um, you don't have to pay attention to like trying to read it down here or anything like that because it's just like that. And that's um, somewhat new for their boxes um, as of late. So that is all I have for you guys today. I hope you enjoyed this unboxing. If you did, don't forget, give it a thumbs up. Let me know I'm doing something right and you are enjoying seeing these. Uh, like I said, I have more to come this week, so keep your eyes open. I'm going to try to get that other unboxing up for you today as well. Definitely, definitely take a look at that one because it comes from a new company and I am super, super excited to um, finish the piece that I got from them and do more in the future. So um, my link for Diamond Art Club is in the description. Don't forget to use that if you want to save yourself a little bit of money and the code SHINE15. Um, other than that, have a great day and don't forget, as always, you are braver than you believe, stronger than you seem, smarter than you think, and you are definitely, definitely loved more than you know. With that, keep on shining and I'll see you next time. Bye guys! Thank you for watching and if you haven't already and would like to subscribe, don't forget to hit that subscribe button below and the bell icon to be notified when I put up a new video.